I'm anxiously awaiting uh, my baby. My baby should be here any minute now. Uh, my baby's the size of a burrito. That's what they tell me. And I cannot wait. So I'm, I'm anxiously, I can't wait. Oh, here we go. Beautiful, beautiful Noggles burrito. Look at that. Freshly delivered. Isn't that cute? Oh, freshly delivered. Oh. Hey guys, welcome back. Noggles man here and got a lot of great stuff to tell you about today. First of all, this is our first episode. Very excited about that. There's going to be many more. We're going to try and do these every week. And what we want to do is we want to um, revolve around the menu. We want to show you different, uh, different items that are on the menu. Uh, maybe something that Christian might be working on, uh, like a little off menu item, a secret, a secret menu or a secret item. So there's going to be a lot of great, exciting things that we're going to be going through throughout the uh, uh, upcoming year. First of all, I want to acknowledge the hard work that Christian has done opening up this new location in Stanton. That's what we're going to be talking about today. And we have the Stanton location on Beach Boulevard opening up. This is Noggle's store number three. So first we had the Fountain Valley Test Kitchen that opened up two years ago, uh, followed by the uh, Huntington Beach location. And now we have the first large uh, location in Stanton that has an actual drive through uh, outside patio seating, uh, inside. It looks like uh, the restaurants that we had back in the 80s, which is really exciting. Christian has worked very hard with his chefs to try and duplicate the exact taste and textures that we all remember as kids from the 80s. Uh, this is done through a lot of hard, extensive work at the test kitchen, and he's gotten it right. Oh, I'm totally stoked. So there was a, a delay uh, getting over here at the new Noggles location, but Christian just made a statement on Facebook that they had to close early. They ran out of food. So, awesome. I'm here at, it's not even 8.30. Stores closed because all the food got sold out. So, it's good news. Sucks for me. So, I'm standing outside with Christian, the owner. Uh, the sign, we turned the lights off. And Christian, why did you guys close early today? What happened? We didn't want to close early, but we just got obliterated. We had a huge crowd, very enthusiastic. Uh, we were doing everything we could to keep up with the demand. And people love Noggles. That's Even 30, 25, 30 years after it started to go away, people, those memories stay strong. Now we're at the drive-thru. I, I heard you had a customer here early this morning. What time were they lining up to be the first drive-thru customer? Uh, from what I understand, there was a uh, guy named Michael who wanted to be the first drive-thru customer right at 7 a.m. when we opened. Wow. Congratulations, Michael. I can't leave here without trying something, so should, should, should I? Should I? Nah. <laughs> Noggles man here, headed on back to the new Stanton location. Gonna give it another shot since uh, it was overwhelmed on the soft opening, as we all know. Big crowd, so hopefully today I'll be able to get in and get some food. We will see. I, um, I have a little dirt on my face. I haven't shaved in a couple days, so I hope you don't mind. I'm saving up to buy some puberty. Attempt number two, looks good. Dan's walking up, Dan doesn't want to be in the video. Stanton location, brand new, about to head on in. Dan's already in there, Christian's on his way. Down at the taco shop. I have a reservation for two. Can we have somewhere near the window? Of course. There's Christian. <laughs> Shakes are made to order. I'm a Noggles fan and I am stalking you.
you gotta see the size of these burritos. I'm a sucker for the beef, uh, the beef burrito. These things are huge. They're like, I, I joke about it all the time, but they are the size of little babies. This is the beef burrito. That's my hand. They're big. Look at the quality of that beef. It looks so tender. Seasoned just right. First off, look at all the cheese. Look at that, is that amazing? Crispy shell. Here's the profile shot. Look at that. Solid foundation of beef. Big chunks of cheese on top. I gotta go in for this. Name this movie. makes their own taco shells so crisp perfectly crisp shredded lettuce diced tomatoes lots of cheese on there which is great lots of cheese everything is grated and done fresh the beef I don't know if you can see this get a little bit of that lettuce off of there check out that beef there's no fillers in there. I was talking to Christian last night. They literally take the beef, put in the seasoning, cook it up, start cooking it up. So, unlike the competition, there's no funky fillers in there. You're getting what you, what you order. The shells, you can see the size of this thing. The original taco is what it's all about. Look at the cheese in there. Crispy shell all the way through. Chunks of meat, lots of meat in there. Would you just look at all that beef? Ladies and gentlemen, we now have a drive through. <laughs> Thank you for visiting Nogglesman. I'll see you next week.